Hi, Sirius Roots here, back with another Distance Incremental video, episode 3, and I'm tier 4 rank 16, and I've gone a total of, um, 3 parsecs, so yeah, that's pretty crazy. I think a parsec is like 3 light years or something like that, and I have unlocked time reversal, so, um, I have 0 time cubes, Transit to zero free rocket fuel. Let's see actually how many rockets. I can get 7164 rockets, which is pretty crazy. And I have a bunch of um, intelligence, so maybe I should start trying to... Actually, I can't upgrade my rank bot. I can upgrade the tier bot a couple times, but that's about it. And I can reverse time. Is this Once you reverse time, all previous resources will be lost over time instead of being gained. And returned, um, you gain time cubes over time okay well first i'll just get a lot of rockets because that's a that's a lot let's see um how, how far i can i can reach i can reach uh i thought it's gonna be a little more than this i mean i am now up to tier four which could get me up to rank 16 but uh yeah it's, it's just gonna take a while even with that many rockets it's because even with all that this, this many rockets it's only it's only being raised to 3.5 power so I think I'll reverse time here. It seems like some sort of dilation mechanic. And looks like I'm just getting a bunch of time cubes. I also have um, this achievement. So yeah, time goes by 1% faster, which I guess is pretty good. I should probably, you know, um, maybe I can get rockets. I'm not sure. I guess this is just like a, it, this feels like dilation, except it's sort of not like dilation. I don't know. It's, it's interesting. I'm not sure if this resets on... I don't think it resets on the... Reset your rockets to gain one rocket fuel. So it's just like... How how many time cubes should I go for? This achievement, I think... There's an achievement that is getting... Yeah, 1,000 time cubes. Where time goes by 10% faster. So... Uh, I feel like... Oh, actually, there's upgrades. I didn't even notice. I didn't even know what these were. This is increased time cubes. Gain... By 10% for each rank of rank or tier. So actually, that that's that's really good. That so I'm gonna get five over five times increase in time cubes. Maybe I should try to grind up to 300 time cubes, which is time goes by log n plus one times faster, where n is your time cubes. So if I have like 100 time cubes, that will yeah it'll make time go three times faster. That's actually really good. So. I'm definitely going to grind to that, and then that should also allow me to pretty easily reach um, this upgrade. The rank requirement formula is 10% slower, and then I'll also try to get this achievement, which will also um, help speed up the game even further. And also, I'm going to be getting this achievement soon, and it also gives me an acceleration boost. So, yeah, that's... Here it is, 300 um, time cubes, and so now the time cubes... Is the rate that I'm getting them is increasing every second. So it'll take about a minute, maybe a little less, to reach the next upgrade. So yeah, I've seen a bit. Okay, here we go. 1,000 time cubes. This allows me to get this achievement and this upgrade. So that should be very powerful. I think I'll grind up to um, 1,000 time cubes again because this will just give me more rocket fuel. And just it's also going to help like this upgrade. And yeah, the next upgrade here is time cube gain is um, increased by 33% for each order or magnitude of rockets and it soft caps after a while. Okay, that's the one other thing that this game is known for, soft caps. It, it, you might have seen some of the news tickers that mention soft caps because yeah, the, the, the whole notion of soft capping something is essentially a meme in like the Discord server of this game. So yeah. That's what that is. Um, but anyway, it, it, seem, it seems like a good boost. And then the next one is Rocket Fuel. is 10% stronger. And then everything else is just pretty expensive here. So I think what I'm going to do, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bring time back to normal. I almost have 1337 time cubes. And just reset my rockets to gain one Rocket Fuel. Hopefully, this does not reset time cubes. Let's see. It does not reset time cubes. So yeah, here's this achievement. And it should be very fast. Actually, I can already get a lot of rockets. Actually, I, I should have done that before. 
Like, do we... Because apparently this is not resetting everything else. So just... I can just gain a ton of rockets that way. So I guess I'm... I'm going to wait here until I can start getting, like, 2,000 rockets. And then get four rocket fuel. And boom. Look at this. This is... This is pretty amazing. I'm, I... Let, let's see. I want... I want more intelligence. I'm, I'm getting intelligence very slowly so it's not really helping all that much but anyway i can gain four thousand rockets let's see what rank and tiers i can get. i can get tier four rank 16 rank 17 here's light years and here is you know, parsecs i need um 15 parsecs to re um reset my journey but rank up so um i could try to get that um i'm currently yeah past my max velocity because my time speed is four and a half times. Maybe I could try to go time reversal again, but not exactly sure if that's worth it. Or I could just try to go for a bunch of rockets. I feel like that's the best idea. Just try to grind up to four E4 rockets because that, 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 yeah, that's gonna, that shouldn't take too much time. Like, look at this, I'm already halfway and I'll give me another rocket fuel and it's starting to actually help stuff. It's, it's gonna boost the effect by, of rockets by, six percent that may like buff this exponent by six percent which could actually be really good and then okay one additional rocket isn't really doing all that much but anyway i look it looks like i will be able to easily get the next rocket field the one after that may take a while and yeah, this is six rocket fuel but uh unfortunately there's no reward is there any reward there's go at least 10 parsecs so yeah, I should, I should try to get that eventually. But first, I will, of course, get this one, or this upgrade here, or this reset. So, this will allow me to... I'm, I'm, then I'm going to push to maybe, maybe not 100,000 rockets, but like at least like 20,000 rockets, because that will allow me to make progress ever faster. So actually, it's actually interesting. Like, this game is actually starting to really get interesting when more of the mechanics are opening up. So, yeah, I'm up to 15,000, and yeah, I'll just go up to, like, a little over 20,000, and that will... Well, let's, see, let's see what ranks and tiers. Rank 16, rank 17. Yeah, I should easily be able to reach 10 parsecs, and that will allow me to get um, this achievement, where the, max, where the maximum velocity is 50% higher. So... It's actually worth going for. So, yeah, there we go. Maybe I should try to rank up again, because that definitely could help. I'm now, yeah, I'm now going over... The maximum velocity is now one light year per second. So, yeah, this is unrealistic, but whatever. These games aren't supposed to be realistic. Um, it doesn't look like I'm really going to get to rank 19. I need three kiloparsecs, which is like... Like, that is like the diameter uh, or not the diameter of the milky way it's like ten thousand light years so yeah that, that's a long distance i guess I'm, I'll, just, I'll just gain some rockets or actually i can reverse time i'm only getting about 37 time cubes per second so that isn't really doing much and i lose uh no i, I don't actually lose the um the distance i, I may lose yeah i lose my velocity but that's about it i probably should push to 2500 time cubes because this will help give me it's a, it's a 3.4 times multiplier to time cubes so yeah that's that's pretty good i'm not exactly sure if i should try to push to um 15,000 time cubes i could guess i can look at all the other upgrades here this one is scrap and intelligence um gain or increase by 10% for every order of magnitude of time cubes. So it's interesting. That will give me about maybe 40% more um, scrap and intelligence. And that, that's definitely, I'll definitely help everything because, yeah, and I'm also losing my scrap and intelligence, unfortunately. So yeah, that's, um, it's, it's actually an interesting mechanic how it's done like that. This is time goes by 5% faster for every achievement gotten. So it's worth it to get achievements once I get that upgrade. It says rank bots interval boosts its magnitude is currently 1.71 times, and tier bots interval boosts its magnitude but not as strongly as the previous upgrade. 
And finally, rocket gain is increased by 10% for every order of magnitude of time cubes, and it soft caps after a while. So, yay, soft caps. But anyway, I don't think there's much I can't... I, I'm, I'm going to go for the rocket fuel is 10% stronger. And then, I'm not sure, maybe I should try to get rank 5 at this point. I feel like that could be a good idea, because I, I'm just so close. Like, I should just get a lot of rockets, and that should definitely help things. I'm just going to wait for this upgrade. It's only now going to be about 10 seconds. And then I should probably actually push again to about um, 10,000 time cubes just to boot, or boost yeah, some of these upgrades. So, also, I could even just wait to get this upgrade until I get maybe like 25,000 time cubes. And, yeah, that's what that's what I'm going to do. And there's not much else I can do while I'm waiting here. Um, I guess I can look at my time speed increase. Maybe I want it to get up to six times. Uh, maybe that's not actually that good. I don't know. I, I think I'll just get this upgrade. Maybe, maybe not now, but, like, I'm really not sure when I should get it. Maybe I'll just get it now. I'll, I'll have 10,000 time cubes. Or not, at least, least 5,000 or 6,000. So here we go. It also gives me actually an achievement. Um, let's see which one it even is. It's this one. Purchase five time reversal upgrades. Doesn't do anything on its own, but whatever. And yeah, I'll, I'll now bring time back to normal. And this should allow me to, well, not, I mean, I could try to reach rank 19 and tier five, but I th I'm just going to get more rockets first. I feel like that's a better idea. Because I, I can gain um, quite a lot, a lot of rockets at this point. So, yeah. I'm not exactly sure what the best strategy is. I think rank 17 is sort of where I cap out. I'm, I don't think it's a lot worth it to try to get another rocket fuel. I think I should just keep trying to grind more rockets because that will give me a higher, like, top speed and everything. So I think that was like 2.6 parsecs per second. Now at 2.8 parsecs per second. So you see everything's just helping, even if a little even if it's just a little bit, it's it's all helping. And maybe rank 18 will help a lot. Uh, maybe it's helping a little bit, but it's not helping as much as I um, hope it is. Uh, and there's actually an achievement. Um, gain 25 rockets. Rocket gain is increased by 15%. So that that's something I actually needed. I I wanted a higher rocket gain. And yeah, now up to four parsecs per second, so it only takes about four seconds to reach rank 18 from 17, which will again allow me to gain even more rockets. I think I should try to push to the next rocket fuel. It'll take a little while, but it shouldn't be too bad. And also, this is gonna actually this is a huge achievement. Reach tier five. The reward is a the rank requirement formula. It's 2.5% slower. That can be huge. So, yeah, and, and I don't think there's anything here that would actually be all that powerful. Uh, I can gain e four E4 rockets there. And, I mean, is there anything else that is powerful? This doesn't do anything. This is all time reversal upgrades, or time will go by 50% faster. So that's pretty good. And then... This one is um, perform a universal collapse reset, where time will go by 50% faster. And yeah, I need 50 mega parsecs. So yeah, that's gonna take a while to to reach because I'm I can't even get the I can't even get to kilo parsecs. So and anyway, I'm getting pretty close to the. Um, reset your rockets to get one rocket fuel. So I feel like I'll do maybe two more runs and Then once I get the rocket fuel, I'll be able to I'll I'll, I'll do one more run because I want to have like good sort of numbers for the, This so I can actually start out with a lot of rockets. So here you go This will boost the 7% up to or 7.4 to 7.6 percent, and it gives me yeah that that achievement, the the one that doesn't even have a reward at all, but whatever. Uh, I sh should be still pretty easy to um, gain rockets. It's it's a little bit harder, unfortunately. And the next one here is 
2.5 or almost 2.6 E6, which is yeah, 2.6 million. I don't think I'm gonna, be, I'm gonna be able to get that many rockets without like really like a big grind. So yeah, I'm just gonna keep gaining rockets like this. It's unfortunate I'm still only getting actually I'm getting 3.4 per second. So that's actually pretty good. And with the rank up, I'm getting 8.6 per second. So yeah, that's sort of how I'm I'm how like sort of like progression here. And actually. That was just like a small rocket reset, and that's giving me like a 20% boost to speed. So maybe it should keep pushing, because like even though even though like this may seem pretty weak, it's like the logarithm used to be maybe like like e10. So if it would the logarithm of that would be just like eight or yeah like yeah eight to the power of that. But now maybe it's it's more it's more like 16, 17, so that actually does add up after a while. And let's see, it, yeah, it's definitely faster, but unfortunately, it will take some time to rank up. So I'm, I'm, I think this rank up will be for next episode. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Peace out.